Now to the ongoing Black Lives Matter protests in the city. After clashes between police and protesters this week, Richmond's incoming police chief is saying his job now is to listen. Our Matthew Foltz joins us live with more on how the recent leadership carousel at RPD will soon land on Gerald Smith. Matthew. Well, the big takeaway from today's presser with Gerald Smith, Jake, was that he says he is ready and willing to listen to community leaders and community members here in the city of Richmond. Now, Smith currently serves at the, as the deputy police chief in Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Department. He's been serving there on the force since 1991, where he started as community police. Now, the mayor's Excuse me, then the appointment of Smith comes just 11 days after William Jody Blackwell was made interim police chief following the resignation of former police chief William Smith. Now, the mayor said Friday that he and other former chiefs looked at several candidates before selecting Gerald Smith. Now, Smith also said on Friday that the job was on his radar once former police chief William Smith resigned. Now, he said, he also says that. He and the mayor's office had mutual phone calls during the whole process, and going forward, he hopes to build this community police relations here in Richmond. A lot of resources, a lot of personnel were diverted elsewhere. I don't think we ever got back to it. And maybe these people here, maybe they don't want community policing, but that's the question I will ask. That's the question I'm going to listen to. Whatever they want, to, whatever they want that's what we're going to do. We're going to work together to bake a good department, great. Now, Smith won't officially resume his role, excuse me, take his role here in Richmond until Wednesday, July 1st. Coming up at 11, I'll explain more into what he says brought him here to Richmond and his take also on police using tear gas on protesters here in Richmond.